I always know that energy is going to be there in a show. I always know the jitters are going to be there. I feel like the more I tell myself not to be nervous, the more nervous I am. I keep myself grounded by thinking about technical things. I really want to make this moment count. I really want to make my foot point here. I want to make this turn happen. It helps me have a more clear head going in. My name is Lauren Lovett, and I'm a dancer with the New York City Ballet. Raimonda Variations is a ballet by George Balanchine with music by Glazunov. It starts out with a core, and they're all in pink, and it's this very ballet idea. Core is smiling, you know, it's all happy, the music is great, and then the core forms a diagonal, and I just come bursting out of the wings. It's a very challenging ballet for everyone involved. It's hard for the core, it's hard for the soloists. You've got all these classical steps that could be predictable steps, but the way that Balanchine put them together, they bring out different personalities in the music and they bring out different personalities within the core, and I think that's really special. Technically, this role demands a lot. Usually you have one of two kinds of dancers. You've got a dancer that can move really fast and jump really high, and then you've got a kind of dancer that likes more lyrical movement. In Raimonda Variations, you have to bring both together. I think that's what makes it so hard. I have two solos in this piece. The first one is my favorite one. It's a little bit slower. It has this going with the flow kind of feel. It ends with these challenging turns into a jump off stage, which I think is a perfect way to end a solo. It's like, here I go, fast and boom. I love the music of this ballet. I think there's like an underlying passionate element to the music, especially in the pas de deux. The strings have this heart-throbbing pull. There are certain moments that you're holding your breath, you're devil paying your leg and hoping that you stay and that your partner has you. But through it all, you love the music so much that you kind of get past those moments that are so challenging and you can just let yourself go. I really love the pas de deux. It's beautiful. We say that there are just two principles in this ballet, but there really aren't. There are, I think, five or six principles in this ballet. The core is all dressed the same. You see them all dancing together in unison, and then out of nowhere, they just surprise you, and they come out, and they do solo variations. I think that's what's so special about New York City Ballet, and everybody's important, everybody matters. Balanchine wanted it to look in unison, but then highlight what's special about people. It makes everyone stronger in the end, and it gives the audience a chance to see different people dance, not just the people that they know. It's a great up-and-comer <laughs> ballet. <laughs>